down at the bottom of the garden, among the birds and the bees. A little lot of little people, they call the pot into bees. There's creepy black eyed bees and love Keep it a secret now, please. It was Christmas Eve, and all the Poddington Peas were wild with excitement. They knew that Father Christmas should be on his way with their presents. Choppy was delivering the Christmas trees, and Zippy was rushing about doing his last-minute shopping. Dumpy had to hang his extra-large stocking outside. Weepy always got a bit tearful at this time of the year. But his friend, Wee McPee, really preferred the new year. Even the creepy carrots were enjoying themselves. The peas were baking and decorating, putting up mistletoe, wrapping presents, and even Grumpy had caught the Christmas spirit. Busy as they were, they remembered the mince pies and sherry sauce for Santa. As Poppy hung his Christmas cards, he was delighted to hear the happy sound of carol singers. All this excitement had not reached Creepy Castle. Bah, thought Creepy. Humbug. He looked around and saw Black Eyed Pea with a paper hat. What are you doing wearing that thing? He growled. Black Eyed Pea stared at the floor. Oh, but boss, it's Christmas. Any more talk of Christmas and you'll be thrown out. A strange noise stopped Creepy carrying on. His mouth fell open when he saw Santa arriving at the castle. Santa was very late with his delivery and asked Creepy to help him. Creepy replied that he would be delighted. A relieved Santa left the castle. Oh, oh, that was a nice thing to do, boss. Black Eyed Pea said. You fool, hissed Creepy. We're not going to deliver them. We're going to keep them for ourselves and ruin Christmas for everyone else. Back at the village, all the peas were asleep. All except Sleepy who was just too excited. Creepy was up early on Christmas morning and he and Black Eyed Pea were most surprised when they heard the sounds of bells and laughter coming from the village. Didn't they miss having presents? Why was everyone so happy? Creepy couldn't understand it. Do you think, he said, that they'll just have a good time anyway, without presents. Later that morning, the peas were surprised to see Santa and his little helper coming down from Creepy Castle. Ho, 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 roared Santa while Puppy jumped up and down. Just a minute, chorused the peas. You're not Santa or his little helper, said PC Pod. Now, what are you up to? Creepy eventually told the truth while Black Eyed Pea handed out the presents. The peas forgave Creepy and Black Eyed Pea and were so pleased to get their presents that they invited the pair to join them. They all sat down to eat Christmas dinner together for the very first time. Down at the bottom of the garden Among the birds and the bees A little lot of little people They call the pot into bees There's creepy black eyed bees and love Keep it a secret now please There's zippy happy and the sweet bees And all the pot into bees The pot into bees